Um, I have made some small slight adjustments to the SUV camper, which we purchased, it'd be 12 months ago now. Um, down here with the bash plate at the front, because um, of the dual cab, my tray always hits if we turn hard left or right it would always hit the bash plate you could tell so i've had to drill out and egg the steel plates underneath so i could push it back just enough i got about probably 50 mil i pushed it back um, and now that's just enough so i got clearance so i can turn the car on almost a nine degree angle without hitting the tray because I have scratched the corners of my tray which I'm not too happy about Enclosed here, we've got our LPG gas bottles, two four kilo gas bottles. So the best part about this Travelmate Evercool fridge is you can fit two 30 packs of beer straight in there, no dramas. Icy cold, perfect. Obviously there's nothing in there now, we've still got a pack. And you've also got your, the freezer. So you can take, what, you can take the baskets out and make it bigger, but we find that easier. You can have your bread up here and your sausages and steaks and meat and whatever you really want in there. Picked up this SUV Grand Deluxe um, camper from Sahara Trailers SUV. They were absolutely fantastic to deal with. Uh, no dramas whatsoever. Uh, if there has been any problem, we just give them a call and within at least a week, we'll have it all fixed, resolved, no qualms about it. Um, with the SUV, it has been great for what we need with the heavy duty suspension, chassis, the whole works is just great. Um, we had everything, when we purchased the camper, we had everything, all the extras added uh, so the fridge, the solar, hot water system, um, air annex. So this great thing takes all of probably five minutes to zip it on, which is the longest, hardest part. And then you sit back, have a coldie, and it blows up within probably three minutes. And it's hard as all buggery. It's only seven pound in it, and it's hard as all buggery. We found also plenty of storage. We keep, obviously, first aid kits, card games, coolers, um, pretty much just everything you need, virtually. Pots and pans, collapsible gear, best invention. Takes, saves so much room. Extra storage through here, which we've still got to pack for the weekend. Another shelf there. You also got your cutting up bench and whatnot here. Moving on to the kitchen, it is, uh, you got hot and cold water straight to the tap, so that's cold and that's hot when it's plugged in. Uh, LED light for when you're cooking, plenty bright all the way through there, more collapsible buckets um, for if you're out or sure, wherever really. Uh, full gas burner, it's better than the one in our bloody house, believe it or not. Um, cutlery, forks, knives, you name it, it's all there. All the other gear, towel, tea towel rack. <coughs> um, moving into the camper. It is aircon, so it is pretty luxurious. We've got our gauges, so there's 200 litre tanks. 200 amp hour batteries, tells you how much percentage is in the battery and how much you're drawing. 
you got your lights, USBs, and 12 volt plugs. Um, inside, we've got our four drawers for our clothes. One, two, three, four. We've also got the stereo, bloody loud, I'll give it that, um, and our lounge, which is fantastic. Oh, just to relax and kick back. It's bloody perfect. So with the queen bed, it's plenty spacious for us two, me and Steph, and the two dogs, Cruiser and Sadie. Yes, I know it's probably stupid, but they do sleep up here while they're learning to go camping without bloody carrying on outside. Um, all the windows open up, so there's plenty of breeze. Best part about it is the aircon. All they do is aircon pipes, there's three of them, they poke up through the side and straight blowing in. Nice 18 degrees, cold air straight to your head. So I picked up the Dual Cab 2020 GXL um, December last year uh, from John Cole Toyota. Great to deal with, no dramas. It was a breeze. Um, I also had fitted clear view mirrors. Best thing I've ever bloody had. So I can see absolutely everything. They extend out, they're electric. Um, the side rails, we've got ARB side rails, ARB ball bar, and that is it. Absolutely stocko rocko, nothing else has been done. Um, it is in the process. We're talking to TJM at the moment on getting, we need the suspension done, UHF, the work's all done to it, lights, racks. Um, also in the process of getting a canopy made. So it's all a work in progress, I guess, but it will get there eventually. We do have a two and a half year plan on traveling Australia with our two beautiful dogs. This is Cruiser, my beautiful boy. And this is Sadie, the little terror, our girl.